feeling your heartbeat through the palms of your hands. And I invite you to just do a little check-in with yourself before this practice. Checking in with your energy, with your emotions, with your physical body. With honesty. Asking yourself, what has your energy been like recently? What has the quality of your energy been like? Have you been full of energy? Have you been motivated? Have you been tired? Just reflecting, not judging. Asking yourself, what's the energy that you bring when you walk into a room? What's the energy that you share with the world? And then what's the energy that you share with yourself? Reflecting on your emotional state. What have your emotions been like recently? Again, not judging them. But just checking in with you. What have these indicators, these emotional indicators, been trying to tell you? Letting this eclipse energy illuminate the truth in your life. Give yourself permission to see truth this morning. Also understanding that this new moon gives us a chance to begin again, to begin again. Knowing that you are exactly where you're meant to be. Sending love to yourself for exactly where you are in your journey, on your path. And we'll take one more deep inhale. Exhale. And now we'll begin our blessing meditation. A blessing out to the world and a blessing onto yourself. <laughs> so taking your fingers, your Jupiter and your Saturn finger are up, your thumb comes over the ring finger and the little finger. Jupiter and Saturn finger up. Elbows rest at your side. We'll close our eyes. Cherishing these last few moments of sadhana. Using this mudra, this mudra of blessing. This is the mudra that the Pope, that Jesus Christ, the Buddha, all of the saints and the sages would hold as they bless the world. So as we connect to this mudra, we chant a call. 
we chant a call, the mantra for transition, to help us transition with change, with ease and grace. A call me mean, the undying, connecting to that part of ourself that is not born and will never die. Our truest essence that exists beyond time and space. A Chanting from your heart, blessing the world with grace to overcome any obstacle, any challenge. A Go through the list of people in your life that you want to bless. Bless all your friends, all your family, all those who even wronged you. Send them blessing. Go one by one. Bless them up as you chant over them. We bless the world. We bless our world leaders. We bless each other. We bless all those in need, all those suffering, we bless all the strangers, the people we have never met and maybe never will. We bless everyone. And then slowly straighten your arms up. Touch the fingers together. Create a triangle. And bless yourself. Bless yourself now. Bless yourself with everything that you've ever wanted. Everything that's meant for you. the love, the abundance, 
the grace. A chance to start new in every moment. Bless yourself up. Listen to the sound of your voice. Slowly bring the mudra down past the third eye, your center of truth, past your throat, the chakra that allows you to speak truth in your life, and then pushing your palms together in prayer pose. You are exactly where you need to be. Feel this deep peace, this love, this radical acceptance, this strength, this clarity, and commit to sharing this love with everyone in your life today and every day. Taking one last deep inhale. Let it go. Exhaling completely. Hands already in prayer pose at the heart center. Eyes gazing inward. You can see the possibilities of your life, of this world. You can see the truth in your life. You can see who you really are. Trust it. And we'll close with three sat nams chanting out our unique vibrational identity given to us by our God, complete and clear, that no one is meant to understand but you. We will chant out our Satnam to close the sacred space, the sacred ceremony. Deep inhale to begin. So to your practice.